Hello, hello, amigos and amigas. This is Marco Santos from Grooveversity. And in today's class, we are gonna learn how to play samba and how to play baião on the cajon with brushes. Yeah, a lot of fun. But as usual, we'll start with the play along and then right after that, we'll break it all down for you, okay? Please remember, subscribe to us, to our YouTube channel, like us on Facebook. We very often do giveaways and you don't want to be left out, right? Okay, so here it is, the play along and then I'll see you in the studio. Fired up! One, two, three, four. Hi there once again, I hope you guys liked the play along and now it's time for the goodies. Now it's time to break it all down so you guys can have fun as much as I did playing samba and bayon. So here we go. All right, so there are mainly two sounds on the, on the cajon, uh, basic sounds, right? So we have a low sound that you get by striking the drum right here. And then you have a high pitch sound. Cool. And then with the brushes, it's really cool because you can, you can play a brush sound like this. You can also do some accented notes like this. Or you can play notes like this. Cool. So now let's go. First rhythm, samba. Okay, on samba, check this out guys, this is really cool. Your dominant hand is playing a pattern called teleco teco. Alright? And the pattern goes like this. One, two, three, four, one, two. Hey, so that is Taleco Teco for the dominant hand with the brushes, okay? And then the non-dominant hand will be playing the bass drum, all right, for, of a drum set. So the pattern is one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one. Cool. Now try to put it together. Oh, <laughs> I can tell you beforehand. It may be frustrating at first, but if it's not challenging, it's not fun, right? No pain, no gain. So <laughs> here it is, teleco teco on the dominant hand and the non-dominant hand playing the bass drum part. One, two, three, four. So yeah, so now I think it's a good time to pause this video and then work on those two guys. And once you have it, you come back here, okay? Then now we're gonna learn the transition, like from samba to baião. We did, we did a phrase that sounds like this. Pa, 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 kung, kung. Yeah? But what is cool about this with playing with the brush is that you can keep the 16th note drive here. What do I mean by that? You can keep playing. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three. Yeah? While the dominant hand is doing the phrase itself, itself, at least part of it. Right? So it goes. Hey, hey. And then 
<laughs> the next part, actually, both hands are playing the phrase together. So it goes. And then the last two notes. So here it is, the full transition. Alright, alright, so then now we have Bayon left. So Bayon, we're trying to simulate the sound of the triangle that is playing uh, 16th notes again. So you're trying to do it with the brushes here. Okay? And then the non dominant hand plays the it simulates a, as a bumba pattern or a drum set pattern too, like this. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Both together. All right, very cool. So, there you go, now you have it, have a great time. And actually, I have a favor to ask. Once you are done, make a video and, and send to us or post in our Facebook at Grooversity, okay? Please don't forget to like us on Facebook. Please don't forget to subscribe to us on YouTube. See you guys soon, okay? Fire it up! <laughs>